Now in this section, I'll be creating this my upcoming tours and destination part on this tutorial. So let's copy the text from here and go to Elementor editor. So previously we have created in, in my previous video, we have completed this section. Now go to Elementor. Okay, so let's take a look. Uh, there is a little background color here and the text so let's add the heading first make it center we can change the uh, heading size later if if we think uh, it way bigger but currently i'm using without external uh, monitor here that's why it looks a little bigger but it's standard size in 2022 not 2020 i always uh, uh, mixed mix up this one copy the text here mm, all the text this 42 pixel and this image add another section upload image from here Okay, so uh, there is upcoming to three images. The first one is this one. Let's add alt text here and click insert. Add a title, copy and paste H3. Uh, this looks perfect. Make it vertical align middle. Add some paragraph here. Uh, well, there is two double paragraph. I personally don't like uh, the click sound from my mouse here, I think. Uh, <laughs> let's make it. Uh, we can make it another column here for this. So this is just a basic tutorial here I'm creating today to make it nicer and make it more professional. You could add so many features here. So it looks great. So there is a lot of space at the left side. Let me add some more space here to make it looks good. I think it looks perfect now. Now let's copy uh, the okay so let's copy this one from here and drag the read more button so you already know how much important this read more button here let's reduce some text to make it horizontal perfect here well, so I have added uh, every single changes here, which is necessary. Let's add some padding, 30 pixel, duplicate, change the position here, click on column, go to advance, make it left zero and right 60 pixel to make it similar. Change image and other settings from here. Uh, it looks much space here i think let's reduce the space margin top add some minus margin 35 is enough let's add also margin minus top minus 35 well It looks good now so we can change the image as well let's change it to this one and make another copy of this one here take this one to the top okay it's not working well so here is another options that you can use which is called navigator 
and using navigator you can change the section position here let's make it from here now as you can see it's working right now so now it looks like this it looks perfect enough i think and let's go back to our editor and design options copy the background color from here we can save this background color inside elementor as well let me show you how you can also do it go to style background paste the color oh my god add hashtag here and right now as you can see the color looks perfect here and i would like to use this color in my elementor uh, color options so just click on this plus icon you can add light busy here now as you can see there is no space at the top and bottom i would like to add some space here so that's why i would like to go to advance and padding inside the padding at 60 pixel top and 60 pixel bottom let's take a look it looks perfect now So I hope after watching this tutorial, well, I already said this a couple of times. I know you can do this. Uh, okay, so let's move into the next part. This is a newsletter sign up section. So I'll be creating this part in next video. Thanks for watching.